preseason. Patrick Mahomes just wowing people, continuing to regular season into the postseason. You're maybe presumptive MVP uh, getting it done today. Uh, here's, though, uh, how things sounded after the game from the quarterback he went up against, Andrew Luck. On the road, you know, we, were, we, were, we were out executed by them. Uh, I think we were out disciplined by them, and that, and that will show up in the penalties. And, and, and it just seemed like we really struggled, all of us, to just get on the same page every play and put some consistent, uh, speaking from the offensive perspective, put some consistent drives together. And, and credit to their defense and a great atmosphere. It was awesome. This was what, you know, this is, this is the type of games you dream about playing on the road. Uh, but we, you know, we all, it, it seemed, my, you know, myself at the top of the list took, the top of the list took our turn sort of messing the plays up, you know. And, and, when, and when that's happening and you can't stop the bleeding, it's, it's tough. It's too hard to win on the road against the number one seed uh, in the AFC. So, again, credit to them. I mean, they, they outplayed us. They, they were the better team tonight. Well, we said in there, it's hard to climb Mount Everest your first time that you go to climb it. And we didn't make it all the way to the top this year, but we made it up that mountain pretty far. And... What we said in there is, just like when you're a mountain climber, you may not make it up the first time, but you learn the path to get up there. And even though you didn't get quite the way, all the way that you wanted to get, we learned some things along that journey, along that climb, that will stick with us as we, as we move forward from this. Certainly some reflection for this team, and here's how the numbers shake out when it's all said and done. 203 passing yards for Andrew Luck versus 278 for Patrick Mahomes. Didn't throw a touchdown pass Mahomes, but the pass rating a little lower than you're used to seeing, but it doesn't really matter. At the end of the day, the Chiefs were able to get it done on the ground and on defense as well. And guys, we talked earlier about this Colts team coming into this game. Momentum. Yep. Uh, the they, they they looked solid against the Houston Texans in the wild card round, and I thought this was going to be a game where they would come in and go blow for blow. It would come down to the final two minutes. What went wrong for Indianapolis, Rod? I, I think the biggest thing, because we, we all thought they were going to come in here and run the football and just smash mouth, use Mac, mm -hmm. make take some of that pressure off of, of Luck, and then play to the defense, because the defense has been playing well. But nine carries for 46 yards, and really the last three carries – he, had, he got some yardage, but the first six, he had early nothing. And then if you don't have a running game, TV, you know there's no play action pass. That's when the defensive linemen can pin back their ears and get after the quarterback, which they did throughout this whole game. And then, you know, the playmakers didn't make plays. I mean, third and six, Ebron runs a five-yard route. Those players have to make plays. And then not 0-9 on third downs. How do you score points if that's, you don't convert third down? Yeah, that's what it was. Watching the game, the first drive, they go 0 and they go you no. Know, 0-3, oh, three, 3 and out. You mm -hmm. punt. Right. KC drives down the field, scores a touchdown. They, they didn't respond. Once again, it was, again, 3 and out. You start, when you're in that situation and you're going 3 and out and the other team are, are putting together long drives and mm -hmm. scoring touchdowns, right. it gets tight. It gets tight That's on that sideline. And you have no rhythm, no, no nothing. And you look at the score, and you're down 14 points. The scoreboard seems like it's just ticking away, and you can't find answers. Luck talked about it. Everybody was messing up. Mm -hmm. You know, not not uh, getting third down, not getting the distance on the third down play, dropping passes, Luck mm -hmm. underthrowing some of his receivers. They all took turns messing up. More on the defense or more on the offense when it's all I said think, and done? I think Casey's defense had some say about that. The first couple of series, you know, uh, Jones batting down the passes, mm -hmm. you know, deflecting stuff. They just they made it where Indy just had no rhythm. They couldn't no completions. They just weren't in sync, and it never allowed them to, to get into sync. Yeah, well, this is not the same defense we've seen all year long for the Kansas City Chiefs. No, no, no not no, at all. The they, Kansas they, City Chiefs have been very inconsistent throughout this year. They've been at spurts. They, we know they can rush the passer. They can do that. We know that. Mm -hmm. But inconsistently stopping the run, inconsistently giving up big plays. I mean, this stuff has happened consistently throughout the year for them. And then today. It just seems like Bob Sutton said a magic word, and these guys played their best <laughs> but, football. But that, for me, is the part that makes you think, hey, look, this team really does feel like a legit Super Bowl contender yep. because the question mark was their defense coming into this postseason. We knew that the offense could put up points on almost anybody, but they ran the football today. They played defense. Two of the biggest things that you can do in the postseason to win football games. You said it. We talked about it last week. Look at this, this stat sheet, and you say quarterback, zero touchdowns. We thought that if he didn't throw any touchdown passes, they would have a tough time beating this team. They ran the ball extremely well. Their defense came to play. 
And it, there is two different seasons. The, the regular season, that is 17 weeks of football, mm -hmm. and we try to say, okay, this defense, based off their stat line, they shouldn't play well. They don't care about that stuff. This is a whole new season. It's a whole new season. They came to play on the offensive yeah. side. They came yeah. to play on the